The last time I was in Sochi was in 2008 to write about this city's Olympics-inspired real estate boom. More than five years later, I'm back, this time to cover the Winter Olympics. Back then, downtown Sochi still retained some of its aura as a Soviet-era resort. The Olympics had been awarded to the city the year before, and construction was just getting started. In the mountains above Sochi, near the village of Krasnaya Palyana, workers were clearing away trees for the ski resort. Now that ski resort, Rosa Hutar, is hosting the downhill competition. In the Imeritinskaya Valley, which was then a sparsely developed area with a beautiful beach about 20 miles southeast of downtown Sochi, people like Svetlana Beristeneva were starting to say farewell to a place they called home. And here is the Imeritinskaya Valley on Thursday. Look left along the ring road in the Sochi Olympic Park, and you see gleaming new stadiums getting ready for the imminent start of the Games. Look right, and you see mud, trash, and beyond that, the Black Sea. For a long time to come, this city will be debating whether all that change was worth it.